Oh, that'll do. That'll do nicely. Uh, beauty, eh? Hey there, welcome to Jersey Jim Fish. Fish Monger Jim here. Right, so I just returned from getting my my Jeep out of the shop. A uh, few different movies going on right now. I'm not sure exactly where this footage is going to go. But one of the primary things I wanted to do when I got my vehicle back was go gather some acorn caps for the tanning project, which is what I am going to be engaged in tonight. Probably work on that uh, tomorrow, maybe. But this right here, well, yeah, that's going to be in a different movie. That's going to be in, in this movie. Hang on, I'll show you that. That's going to be in, oh, it's in this tub. Hopefully, I haven't looked yet. Hopefully it's phenomenal. Oh yeah. So this is halibut skin leather. And that is going to be awesome. Well, a little bit of discoloration from uh, not moving it around, but yeah, so the, um, the acorns are going to augment the tea, the tea leaves in uh, you know the acquisition of tannins. That's the idea behind that. Well, I should have moved these around a whole lot more. I don't think it'll really matter. A very weak tea solution in there right now. I am, uh, like I said, I'm getting ready to boil these uh, to make some tannin for tomorrow. I do have a pot of tea all ready to go. And then these, these, uh, hold on a minute, let me wash my hands. I don't want to, you know. Oh, I can already tell this stuff is going to be beautiful. Well, minus the big hole in this piece. Oh, let's see. Is the oldest of the teas, I think. Tan this one uh, in the fish tub. With, uh, without refrigeration, I think. I think I'm gonna do it, do it that way. It's pretty cool out. It's probably 50, 50 degrees or so. Yeah, these, I clean them up really, really well. Uh, not that one. I didn't spend too much time on that one. Sorry about the lighting. Wow, that's a lot. So these are last year's uh, acorns, and some of the tannins have been leached out. So I'm using kind of more than I think I really need or should, would, if they were fresh off the tree. And again, I'm gonna be augmenting the solution with tea. What's that? I want that boil for, well, I don't know. Um, down. I 
Yeah, I think we're gonna go 40 minutes with this instead. Here's the simmer though, it's kinda of how much. Alright, that's the one. So I have to make uh, what I call, it's a uh, steak where you run the skins over. And I think that's gonna be. So one of the movies that I watched about tanning leather, uh, Buddy had a tool that he used to, to roll the leather. Uh, it was kind of like a paddle, like a, um, it had a radius to it, right? And then it had grooves cut across it this way like saw grooves, I guess. So, yeah, I think we can make that. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to complete it tonight, but it seems pretty uh, pretty straightforward. Um, maybe just a one-sided one, right? Because I'm not, he was doing like whole animal hides, like uh, cows and, and sheep and such. So yeah, just for, yeah, one-sided. Absolutely, we can make that. Yeah.
right so real quick just wanted to show you this um, I don't know how well the GoPro is gonna pick this up but this is the T this is what I've been using you can see the clarity of it this is the uh, acorns that's the acorns that is like a stout it looks like a stout or at least a porter in color it's a good way to explain it huh this one would be more like a black and tan or a bitter and then this one this one here's my coffee if anything the coffee looks more like the um, like the acorns but that that's the uh, the halibut overnight right so it absorbs it takes something out of the of the liquid and that something would be the tannins and some color but yeah let's move over to the uh, the table and we'll get started with this with this process here